What's up, guys? Trainer Fred here, Studio Sweat on Demand. 45 minute cycle today. Fighter theme is the thing we're going to do today. So, you know, I'm very excited about this workout because you know how I love for me and yourself to bring your A game. Also, championship mindset and winner spirit. Let's get warmed up and let's go. Get even more Studio Sweat on Demand with our seven day free trial. We've got a huge library of live and on demand workout videos, all filmed in our studio and featuring real people just like you. Download our app today. What's up, everybody? Trainer Fred here. Fighters team today, so hope you're ready to get it in today with nine rounds all out cycling today just get those pedals moving nice flat road just getting started so let's work on a little form little technique hands are light on the bars shoulders are down the pedals just moving at a pace that feels comfortable so basically eliminate the bouncing in the seat and turn the pedals upon field so once again, fighter thing today, so I'm going to kind of push you out that comfort zone today. It's going to be up to you to challenge yourself throughout our 40 minutes here. But have a good time, enjoy yourself throughout. So let's maintain that pedal stroke over 90. Add a little resistance to your wheel or add a gear. Effort level still pretty light, very doable. We have four minutes of flats here. Just working on that nice, good pedal stroke. Engage your core. Pedals go up, pedals go down, they go around. Let's get a nice, good effort pedal stroke here. Before we get going, what's up, Wendy out of Michigan and all the other Wendy's out there? What's up, comrades? I know you guys are ready to get it in today. And what's up, studio? I know we're ready to get rocking today, right? Yes. Here we go. For 10 seconds, pick up your pace by the 10 RPM. Little stir here. And then slow it back down, 5 to 10 RPM. Back to that nice, effortless pedal stroke. Once again, right now, you're a nice cage window. 90 to about 110. But whatever feels comfortable in that range of numbers. If you do not have a console, remember, follow my leg speed. Try to keep up with the tempo if you can. So, enjoy that. All right, let's try to get another gear or just a little tad of resistance on your wheel. Just a little bit. As long as you maintain that pedal stroke over 90, RPM, you're doing great. Here we go, nice and easy. Add just a little bit, we're gonna stand it up here. Yeah. So first trip out of the saddle, just nice and easy. Just getting a feel of that cycle. So three minutes here, not all standing. I cue you down into the seat. Handlebar position right now, position one or position two. I'm gonna try to avoid position three because I'm trying to stabilize my body, warm up and conserve energy. Have a seat, here we go. Nice easy push, somewhere in that 80 to 90 range. Here we go in three, two, one. Bring it up, easy. So once again, whatever feels good here. You're probably somewhere in that 60, uh, low 70 range. You're trying to stabilize your body. So less movement, elbows in. It's gonna help you stabilize.
All you have to do is lift the pedals. Your body weight is going to push them down. And the seat. That's how it's going down today. Can you add another gear or a little more resistance? Here we go, bring it up. Maybe starting to bring the hands out position three. But once again, I would still keep my hands in two or one because we're just warming up. Once again, you can conserve energy here, but also warm your body up. Speaking of bodies warm, you should feel your body's core temperature start to increase. That's a good sign. That's a good sign that good things are about to happen. Here you go. Have a seat. Push. Push. Work. Here we go, looking good. Should be feeling good at this point. As you turn the pedals, start to lose resistance back to your flat road. Working on down. Here we go, once you get back to that flat road, push back. Here we go, we're going to stretch it up. There you go, nice good pre-stretch. There you go. Crank it out, squeeze. Hands are down. Take them to the back, pull the shoulders down. A one opportunity. Good, bring that right or left arm across the body. Everything you ever wanted. In one moment. There you go, switch it over. Would you capture it? Or Here's just let it slip? Yo, these it's opportunities. All right, we come right out of the gate with two like, minute and 45 seconds sprints. So remember, this is going to be high tempo, uh, mainly to about 110 effort level. So we're talking about a three part, no more than a four, because we have a lot of push this morning. So you're thinking about endurance on this one. So I kill you when it's time to add a little resistance right now. You're just filling those minds up with positivity, the opportunities that's going to be out there for you to go get today. To these ropes, it don't matter. He's dope, he knows that, but he's broke. He's so stacked that he knows when he goes back. All right, three, four, home dance when it's back two, to the lab again. Yo, one, this whole rap's add a couple gears, add a little bit of pace. Come on, about a minute and 45 seconds. Nice, good sprint. Effortless pedal stuff. This your chance to blow this opportunity. Can't let it go. You only get one shot. Don't miss these opportunities. Don't be saying what have, should have, could have at the end of class today. Take advantage of every time you get an opportunity to push yourself and take advantage of your work. Feel free to take this too. More of a push here. Because once those shoulders come forward, you engage that core, you're going to get that lift of those knees, that power is going to come out of those legs. There you go, open up that stride. Don't be afraid to come down here and work. But those pedal stripes still remain effortless. Remember, this should not be too challenging. This should be very doable. Here you go, looking good, looking strong. As we should be, because this leg should be fresh now. Starting to slow the tempo. Starting to push back. Push all the way back. This hole that Catch the breath. This easy, 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 easy. So king. slow the pedal for recovery, New right? I know I'm a yeah. life is boring. Right hand to the spine. Close to post mortem. It only grows harder. Only grows harder. Switch he it over. blows it all over. So we're he still in that getting ready process. Coast to coast shows he's known as the globe trotter. How does the second warm up? So after recovery, anytime you get to recover, it's okay to move your body around, right? 
All right, let's see if we add a pattern resistance or one more gear on your wheel. Turn the pedal slow. I'll let you know it's time to push, because remember, we got like a minute and 45 seconds to work with. Here we go. Take your hands down. Try to pick up the pace. Lady, it's about 105 RPM here. There you go. Lose yourself to the music. Let it go. You only get one shot. Opportunity. Here you go. You hear that beat pick up? Yeah, take it down to the racing profile. That's that time to take those hands down. Gaze that core. Work those pedals. One, two, one, two. Woo -hoo -hoo. I like to call it turn and burn, baby. Turn and burn. Hold on to it. Again, it should be doable. Almost there. Just trying to stay consistent with your pedal stroke. How are you trying to do? So keep working that tip over 90, but take to position one. You're starting to cut back to about that 90 RPM range because we're going right into a four and a half minute climb. Right into it. So slowing the pace into the 80, maybe 90 RPM range. Add some more gear to stand. We're here for about 90 seconds to start. So once again, you can be in the overhand grip in the front because you're just coming out of that push. But once those hands start coming out and out, more work, more work, more work. So be careful where you are with your hand placement. Tempo right now, mid-60s. If you're a tempo rider, you're probably at 65. RPM hit. A down stroking leg right on the beat. Who's back? He's gonna say, I am. <laughs> Who's back? I, there we go. Tell yourself. When someone asks you a question, I want you to respond. You know, there we go, come on. Let's lift the pedal. Nice and smooth, transfer the widest part of the seat. Good. We're probably somewhere in the mid 80, uh, mid 70 range. So 75 is about 85 RPM. It'll be a nice, good seated tempo. And the reason I ask you who's bad because Mentally, we got to be there today. Remember, you're going to be challenging yourself today. So mentally, I need you strong in the mind. Bring it up. Come back. I love to talk to myself in third person. Because you're your best cheerleader, right? Take it to the seat nice and smooth. Opportunity. Add a gear or a little more resistance. Bring that RPM down. I'm climbing higher, but I'm climbing stronger. There you go. Three, two, one, bring it up. Now this is your time to take it out position three. Little hover. There we go. Once again, work on keeping those elbows in. Now hips over the seat. Shows them more parallel to the ground. Yeah. I like that. Who's back? 
Uh, I asked you a question. Who's that? I am. I am. Come on. Yes. You know it. You know it. You ever moonwalk on a bike? Upper body's quiet. Upper body stabilized. Moonwalk with me. Upper body's quiet. Woo hoo! This how you moonwalk on a bike. This is how you moonwalk on a bike. And anytime you empty, you moonwalk, right? Bring it down. Let's recover the seat. Lose it all. Quick recovery. If I was a bed man, we're going into the bottom sprints. Get ready for Tabata. Bottom. Yeah, it don't get no better than that. Remember, 20 second intervals, 10 seconds of recovery. There are eight of these. Five, four, Let's turn, three, turn right a little bit. First two, one, one. practice. One. There goes first one. Hold on. Wait up. You can't stop this here. You can't top this tier. Work too hard, my God. I'm going to play my card. I'm going to leave your atmosphere. It's so good. Take that first 20 seconds. I'm going to wear their plots in, but I got no option. And I can't be stopped. I'm going to keep on walking. In my power, in my purpose, and that back by is so worthless. And my faith on me is working. Two, I'm one. 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 We're just going to hold on Rest. to resistance. Slow it down. Cycle one right. complete. So we get about three of them in. We'll add resistance. Prepare. Here we go. Push and work. So we'll use the first two for a little bit of recovery. Effort level is probably about a two. No more than a four on these. But now things are about to change. Two, one. All right, this is where we're going to start adding a little bit of gear on each one. Get ready to add a little bit. Three, prepare, two, and add some, work. now push. Effort level is just jump to about a six, seven, or eight. Because you're unstoppable. Three, two, one. Recovered. Rest. Down the back for a little bit. Three, complete. Here we go. Enough time to push back, catch some breath. But that goes fast, right? Three, Prepare, two, and one. Work. Add some, push. Now you're working to bring your RPM somewhere in that mid 90 range. These are 20 second power intervals. So less pedal strokes to make it happen. Three, two, two one. one. Recover. Rest. Cycle four push back. complete. Four down. Four to go. Opportunities. Get ready. Prepare and Add it on. work. Come on, push. Here you go. Up, up, down with the pedal. Up, up, down, down. Come on. Come on, push. Push. Three, two, one. Recover. Rest. All right, Cycle on this five, next one, complete. I want you to concentrate on lifting the pedals up only, right? For 20 seconds. Watch the different muscles that kick in Prepare play. Prepare and Add it. work. Concentrate on lifting up, not pushing down. Up, up, up. Core, hip flexors. Come on, pull them up. Here you go. Lift the pedals up, up, up. Come on, bring them up. Three, two, one. Recover. Rest. All right, and this Cycle one, six, complete. 10 seconds, we're going to lift up. The last 10 seconds, we're going to push the pedals down. Watch the difference it makes. Prepare and Add resistance. Work. Pedals are coming up. Come straight on, lift them up, pull up. All right, here we go. Push down. Feel the difference Three, in that pedal stroke? Two, one. Cover. Rest. Now we're going to put it together. Seven. Lift Complete. up, push down. Find the right tempo and position to make it happen. Prepare. Here we go. Add and on. Work. Lift up, push down. There you go. So full circle is what you're trying to get in these. Come on. Come on. Last one. Come on. Get to recover after this. Real Three, good. Two. 
One. Lose it all. Rest. Tabata eight. Woo. Complete. Now, recover 60 seconds to for recover. one minute. Yeah, 60 seconds. Can to get our bearings back. So lose that resistance, please. Because you should want more than 60 seconds, you know, if you kind of challenge yourself in those last six. Remember, that's four minutes of continuous work, but it's equivalent to 20 minutes of production. So I know we all love shortcuts, right? What's that shortcut, Tabata? Four minutes of work to give you 20 minutes of production. That's why they're challenging, but that's why they're so awesome. All right, take a sip if needed. So after all that push, you know it's time to come out that seat for some climbing. We're gonna slow everything down. Just start to add a little resistance to the wheel. Keep the pedal slow. Keep the pedal slow. Now add enough to feel that pull back. It's pulling me back, right? And bring it up. There you go. I told you, fighter theme. We're gonna be fighting today. We're gonna be grinding today. You're gonna be challenging yourself today. Walk in a champion, leave a champion, right? That's how we walked in. We're gonna leave with two arms up now. <laughs> All right, get ready to take it in the seat. Down to the widest part of the saddle. A little push here. A fighter. There we go, fighting those pedals today. Alright, get ready to bring him again, but. We got to challenge ourselves with a little more resistance on one more gear. Three, two, one, add it, bring it up. There you go, come on. You're probably somewhere in that 60 RPM range. If not, add resistance to bring yourself there. Lift the pedals. Take it to the wide part of the seat. Makes you work harder. That's what makes you a fighter. You have to keep working. You gotta keep pushing. There you go. Oh, you're gonna bring it up one more time. But we already know what needs to happen, right? Challenge yourself to change yourself. Add another gear, a little more resistance. All right, here we go. Bring it up for the last 90 seconds. Good time to take it out to the hover, right? Hello, glutes. Hello, hamstrings. How we doing today? When you get in that position three. Now this is where the resistance should be challenged enough to where you're putting your body in each downstroking leg, kind of pushing from right to left or left to right. Lift the pedals. By the way, push them down. Come on. Stronger. Fight up, keep fighting. Remember, every pedal stroke counts. Each one of them, each last one of them. So take advantage of each last pedal stroke. 30 seconds, come on. Woo! Finish strong. Show me you're a fighter. Lift the pedal, come on. Much stronger. Bring position one. 
Ease into the seat. Find that flat row real quick. Quick recovery for about 30 seconds. So first recover the legs. Find that flat row. 595 to 110 for 15 seconds. Once you find that, come up. Hydrate is needed. All right. We have three seated power surges. Right now we're in flat row. On my cue, I'm going to say add by four or five gears or crank the resistance hard for 30 seconds. Add it now. Crank it. Big push. Effort level for these. Once again, so we're in that six, seven, maybe eight range. If you got it. Yes, you were. Eat him up. Here we go. Bag it off. Come back up for recovery. Remember, active recovery. I can move my arms here, right? It's active recovery because I just pushed myself very hard for 30 seconds. I deserve a little recovery. So if you don't feel you deserve this recovery, push yourself harder on the next one, right? Bet on yourself. Bring it down. Been working your entire life. This is what it's all about. Here we go. Add some resistance. Big push. Come on. Prove that you're invincible. Prove to yourself you're unstoppable. Come on. Come on, 15 seconds. Woo -wee. Start to slow it down. Recover. Woo -hoo. All right, we got about 60 seconds here. All right? Reason that. We got about a 90 second push to finish this set up. We about to throw some jabs. We about to throw some hooks. We gonna throw some haymaker stories in. But let's do this. There we go. Is it a good time to really hydrate better here? We got plenty of time. Because once we get close to the end, it's gonna be less time to recover. Less time to hydrate. Because that's when I need you to be your best. When you're a little bit fatigued, a little bit tired. I know what you can do when you're fresh. But what can you do when you're a little tired? Look for team. We're about to find out, right? And up here you're saying, I'm not worried about it, man. I'm not worried about it, Fred. I got this. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. Crank it over. Come on. 60 seconds. Big push. Yeah. Remember, lift up, push down. Use your form. Use your technique. Lift the pedal, pedal. Push the pedal. Don't just turn them. Breathe. You have to keep sending oxygen to those working legs. Come on. Come on. Now you're fighting to sustain what you're doing. You're almost there. Come on, you got this. I'm right here with you. Fight that burn. Fight that urge to stop. Fight that urge to quit. You keep working. Five, four, three, two. Up easy. Just eat up easy. You got to touch nothing. Up easy. Slow it down. Get the heart rate to come down, right? You need this to come down. Take it to the seat. Lose about half that resistance. Put a couple gears down. We'll cover here. So we're going to do the same thing, but we're going to come out of the saddle. So remember those two 30-second push in the seat? We're going to do those seated. That last 60 to 90 seconds seated, we're going to do that standing in attack mode. So attack mode means hands position two or one, RPMs in that 70 to 80 RPM range. That's what makes it challenging. 
This is where all the survivors in this. We survived to this point. Here we go, crank it over. Bring it up, come on. Elbows in, hips to back, shoulders parallel, then up, up, up with the pelvis. Come on. Go feel that first one out. I'm gonna work harder. Come on. Push it nice and smooth to the seat. Lose a little bit, recover. All right, that was the first one. Use that for practice. We have another one just like that. So the reason why my elbows are tucked in and make me more stabilized on the bike. No, I can get that higher RPM because you want to watch higher RPMs in just a three. Because you have knees and hips that you want to protect, right? All right. Get ready. Add it on. Bring it up. Come on, attack. Tell yourself, give up. I'm going to work harder. Tell yourself, come on. Throw the pedals up. Throw them around. Come on. Come on. Three, two, one, down the seat. Woo! All right. Just last, remember, 60 seconds. Get ready. Because you're trying to maintain that 7 to 8 RPM pedal stroke. So, positive thoughts now. Championship mindset. Winner spirit. Turn it on now. In three, two, one. Crank that resistance. Bring it up. Come on. Let's fight. By this point, your tempo should be set. Now you're trying to maintain. Four, elbows in. Hips over the seat. Shoulders parallel. Lift the pedals up towards the bars. Come on. Now breathe. Come on, that's fresh energy for the legs. That's fresh oxygen for the legs. All right, here comes that burning sensation. This is where the fight really starts. Come on. This is where you have to challenge yourself to change yourself. Fight to burn. Come on. I'm going to work harder. Come on. Make it. Starting to slow it down. Push it down into the seat. Starting to lose it down the flat road, gradually, gradually. Once you get there, bring those shoulders up, Musa. Because yes. if I'm a bad man, we're going right back into another round of Tabata sprints, right? Because this is where we got to get you. Yeah, this is where that, that fight gets tough. You're fatigued. But I believe you can win. I believe we're going to get back up. The first one's going to be simple. Right where you are, upright. Turn your pedals. Right here, come on. Right here. This is the first one right here. Crank it out. You're going to need this recovery. Three, two, one, break. All right. The next step. Crank the resistance. Add gear. F level. Six, seven to ten. Here we go. Three, two, one, one. work. Crank it. Just warming up, remember? Just warming up. Six more opportunities. Get ready. Add those gears. Three, two, Add those one. Resistance. Work. Stay with me. I. I believe. Come on. I. I believe. One. Cover. Woo hoo hoo. Still warming up. You're still warming up. I know it. Eat them up, though. Let's eat these up. Get ready. Three, two, one. Add work. 
Big push. Remember, up, up, down, down. Use your form. Don't just muscle these things out. Come on. I believe that we will win. Push. Recover. Woo -hoo -hoo. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. I know the challenges they're supposed to be. Challenge Three, yourself. Two, one, Come work. On. I believe that you will win. I believe that you will win. Come on. Come on. Three, two, one, Come break. On. Woo -hoo. Dig deep. Dig deep. Dig deeper than that. That's what it takes. We got this. I'm right here with Three, you. Two, one, Add it. Come work. on, let's go. 20 seconds. From the bottom, I'm that uncut, real raw yeah. When things get tough, yeah. that's when we show up yeah. That's when we show out, yeah. that's when we show y'all It's time to knock them up, knock them up And fight them hard, right now let's all fight them hard Three, two, one, one cover Woo-wee! You're getting stronger, you're getting fitter You're increasing your fitness and health Hang on to it, your metabolism Three, two, is in a chokehold Come on, crank it out, fight Push the pedal. Six percent is all you need. Forty percent has already been done for you. Come on. Hammer down. Two, one, break. Okay, we got one more. I know you say your best for last. I know you say your best for last. Let's do this. Let's do this, everybody. Come on. Ah. I believe, come on. I believe that. I believe that we will win. Push. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Three, two, one, recover. Woo! Lose it all. Lose it all. In through the nose, out through the mouth. Those pedals need to be moving slowly. You have to inhale for four seconds, hold it for four, release it for four. We call that four by four by four breathing. As I know, initially you want to reach for this and throw this into the body, right? This heart slam. It's like, uh uh, slow me down first. Slow me down first, right? If your car overheat, would you lift that hood up? When you see that steam, and put that water in that right there. No, you're not. You're going to let that steam evaporate. The car is going to cool down like your body. Then you're going to take that top off. Then you're going to hydrate up. Mm. Now I can work again. Because the reason why I need to get my car back on the road, because my house is up there. My house is on top of the hill, right? And I got to climb three minutes to the top of the hill where my house is. Then I can park this car and it can stay where it needs to be. All right, let's get these cars up this hill. I didn't tell you to move up there. That was your fault. You should have stayed down low, but no, you chose to build a house on the top of the mountain. So let's go. Crank it up. Three minutes to the top. Nice, slow, strong. Strength, endurance, determination. Rising up, back on the street. Yeah. In my time, took my chances. Went the distance, Here we go. Back on my Work feet. with your bike. The man and his will to it's okay if your RPMs so are that 40 to 60 RPM range. Gotta have it though. Ah, the tiger is the thrill of the fight. So you're excited for this fight. Because you know what good it can do for you. Gotta have it. Ah, the tiger. Come on. 
Lift the pedals. Here you go. Come on. All the heat. Almost there. 60 seconds. This is where you press that little power button you've been saving behind that right ear. If you didn't know you had it, reach behind your right ear. Press it. Instant energy. Come on. Finish strong. Those goals that you have, you have to earn them. Those couple minutes you want, you got to earn them. Nothing comes for free. Come on. The hard work pays off. 20 seconds. Come on. Position one. 10 seconds. Position one. Slow it down. Flat row recovery. Lose it all. Get down here first, remember. Flat row. Nothing on the wheel. Find 95 to 110 by 20 seconds. We're trying to get that tightness out of the legs. We're trying to get that blood to circulate back up. Right there. Legs, you'll start feeling like those are your legs again. There you go, bring it on down, cool it on down. Push back, keep working. Take out the hands. Here we go, roll those shoulders up. Exhale here. One more. Stretch the right arm all the way up. Stretch, reach. Ah, take it to the spine. Stretch it back. Bring it across. Twist it up. Stretch. Opposite arm. Take it to the spine. Bring it back. Across. Bring it up. Position two. Three. Stand in the pedal. Take a deep breath in. Push the hips back. Drop your heels down. Stretch. Roll it up. Reverse the pedals down and around. Take that deep breath in. Exhale back. Roll it up. This is where we're going to unclip, uncage, and finish up some more stretching on the floor. All right. Hands to the side. Feet nice and wide. We're going to take it down nice and deep through our heels. As you're starting to go down deeper, Work your hands down, lower towards your bike. As the hands get lower, the hips get deeper. Weight in the heels. Now take your hands forward as you can. Full body weight. Exhale, bring it up. All right, we're going to stretch the quads. Grab a heel, grab an ankle. Big inhales and exhales throughout the stretch. Switch it over. Woo! I feel like a champion. I hope you feel like a champion, because I know you're a champion, right? We walk in champions, we leave as champions. There we go. So this one, I'm going to drop my seat down a little bit. Uh, feel free to keep your seat where it is. The reason why I'm going to drop my seat down is uh, I want to get my leg nice and straight. So as my shoulders are coming down, I'm stretching the back of the hamstrings and the glutes, and I'm going to reach under that arm, grab that ankle. I'm going to line my head up with my knee. And now also I'm going to try to reach down a little deeper, see can I get to the toes and pull my toes back towards me. This one, feel free to hold longer if you can, because this one that makes a difference. All right, switch it over. Get that leg up. 
right here. Bring the shoulders down first. Don't reach. Bring the shoulders down until they come, 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 not come down any further. Then take a deep breath in and exhale, reach. Another exhale breath, reach further, maybe for the toes. Feels good, huh? No, that feels good. Woo! So that's it, everyone. Thanks for joining me today for the fighter theme. Trainer Fred, hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. You get knocked down 10 times, you get up 10. Trainer Fred is out. Studio, we're out. Let's go home. <laughs>